Okay guys, now we're going to start talking about conditional statements in the next couple of videos. And a conditional statement, um, it's going to enhance your code and allow you to do a lot of different things because a conditional statement allows you to test if some condition is true or false. Like if there's a value in a cell, you can test that condition. And there's two main types of conditional statements, an if statement and a select statement. But before we get to those uh, if statements and select select case statements, um, we're going to go over what a relational operator is because we need to know what they are. Um, so let's insert a module here. I'm going to go insert module. I'll rename the tab if statement. And this is where we're going to write our if statements in this module here. But before we do that, like I said, we want to talk about relational operators. And all they do is define a relationship between two things. So let's say, for example, you have two numbers. Um, here's, here's the operators that that can define a relationship between those two numbers. Um, I'll just put in comments. You have six operators. So one operator is that the two numbers can be equal. So this is a relational operator. That's just the equal sign. Another operation or operator that can define a relationship between two numbers is, is this uh, this operator here which is the greater than sign and then or the less than sign and the greater than sign that means not equal so here we have the two numbers are equal uh, so you could do something like 4 is equal to 4 um, or 4 doesn't equal 5 so these are our relationships right here's a relationship between two things 4 is equal to 4 and another relationship 4 doesn't equal 5 and then you have other relationships like um, 5 is greater than 4 and uh, 6 is less than 8 so these are operators these are the relational operators the equal sign the uh, the not equal sign which is which is uh, the greater than and less than sign together and then you have a greater than sign and a less than sign and what else do we have we have greater than or equal to so 7 is greater than or equal to 7 and 9 is less than or equal to uh, 10 so there's six operators and the operators again are these things I'm highlighting here the equal sign the not equal sign the greater than sign the less than sign the greater than or equal to sign and the less than or equal to sign and all these operators do is define a relationship between two things in this case we're looking at numbers so we have six different relations relationships here uh, between two numbers in each case so four is equal to four and four doesn't equal five and so on right um, you could also do it with text so you could you could say does this word equal that word? And we'll, we'll see that we'll see that uh, later in the video. And there's all kinds of videos on the website that 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 use these relational operators. But the main point is you have to understand that there's these operators that can define a relationship or compare two things. So now that's it for this video. It was just a real short video on relational relation relational operators. They should say relational. In the next video. Um, we'll go over logical operators and why do we need to know this because we're going to use them in if statements in the conditional statements okay